So yes, it's that time once again. Because you guys probably know, I love pack openings. And I'm excited because 2K ended up releasing these Flash 6 packs, which actually look pretty fire. Because in these packs, we have some insane players, including Diamond Glenn Rice, Jeff Petrie, Blake Griffin, also Byron Russell. But this Dino Raja literally looks like the most overpowered Amethyst in the game. Probably the best budget card in the game as well because he's glitched and can shoot threes. Also, he has uh, very long arms. But then we also have a glitched Carmelo Anthony and a glitched Kyrie Irving. I need both of these cards and I really want to do a Melo game gameplay as well. But then of course we have to have a Galaxy Opal and that man is none other than Galaxy Opal Hakeem Olajuwon. Yeah, I need to rock this card too. He looks absolutely crazy. So of course we got to do a pack opening. We got to buy some VC. I also kind of just realized these packs are going to be so good for Lamelo's legacy. And yo, your guys' support has continued to be insane on all the videos recently. So let's just see if we can get a quick 2,000 likes on this one. I know we can. Can't? What was that? Anyway, it's time for us to now open up these boxes. I really do like flash packs. I feel like they probably are one of my favorites that come into the store just for the fact as this box is taking forever to load just for the fact that they're not like deluxe packs you guys saw my last pack opening it actually did go really well because you know i got pretty lucky with two galaxy opal pulls but i don't know i just don't really like opening up deluxe packs just because i feel like you see the flash so often you know pretty much it's going to be an amethyst so i don't know we haven't seen a flash yet maybe i probably shouldn't be talking about that but pack number four this one's going to be good amethyst right there we want it to be dino just because as i said he is quite possibly the best budget card in the whole entire game. So 91 overall, number 40. I'm pretty sure I know who this is. This is Dino Raja. I feel like he has to go for at least like 15K, doesn't he? I love this card. Because yeah, seeing that also gets me super excited for the budget squad, which I'm probably going to release tomorrow as it's going to be a banger of an episode because I've been grinding on that account quite a lot. And to be honest, I haven't really been playing on this account just because I love playing on the budget squad so much. So we've had one shake so far. Ruby here, Carl Anthony Towns. Hey, that's okay. Number eight is going to be... Okay, well... Really, it's not, it's not. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's the go with me right now, but I am so tired. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I literally just woke up and I usually wake up at 3 a.m. in Australia because that's when this content is released and it's time for me to do my video to do a pack opening. But yo, for some reason right now, I am so much more tired than I've ever been to do a video. So hopefully this video is gonna go okay. Hopefully you guys enjoy my commentary and hopefully our pack luck can get a bit better because right now it's really not looking the greatest number four okay cool as i say all the time though it can change in one pack and that mellow i need that card because looking at his stats he looks absolutely crazy because if you guys don't know glitch cards this year aren't really based around positions they don't usually change positions it's usually to do with their stats which i love because mellow is now one of the best defenders in the game as we do get another shake let's see pink okay well it's fine. It's another, it's another Amethyst. I feel like there is another Amethyst player in this. So let's have a look. Eastern Conference, 91 overall, number 23. That is going to be that other player. And that is Blake Griffin. I mean, we'll take it. Thanks, Blake. He doesn't look that good, to be honest. I actually thought this was going to be a really good budget card because his pink diamond was really good. But I don't know. Looking at the stats, I wasn't super impressed. So two Amethysts so far. Not too bad. The final pack of this box. Let's get to it. Let's see the shake and let's end off with a, okay, a diamond. I was about to say with a bang and that's not bad at all. This is hopefully going to be Glenn Rice, who again is probably going to be a really good budget card. 93 overall, number 45. And that means it is going to be uh, Jeff Petrie. It took me a little bit to remember who it is, but Jeff, welcome. Jeff, Jeff. Yeah. Now let's get into this one more box. But one thing that I do have to say about these packs that I was a little bit disappointed, the content that was released today is why not just make Melo a Galaxy Opal? I feel like that would just make him look so much better on paper. Sure, like the stats could be exactly the same, but he deserves to be a Galaxy Opal with the stats that he has. And also I feel like it would make it a lot more hype. That might just be me though. Cause I don't know, right now I run a full Galaxy Opal team except for Steph Curry, now that I think about it, okay? But still, I would love the opportunity to be able to, whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Two shakes, all right. One's an Amethyst, the other one is a diamond. Uh, you don't see that too often, everyone. And we just got it, especially with two different shakes. Let's get the Amethyst out of the way. Oh, what? This is going to be Blake Griffin. So I feel like the other one's actually going to be a current day player. That's weird. So let's go into our diamond and see which current day one it is. LeBron James, Western Conference, 92, number 30. That means it's going to be Steph Curry. Speaking of the devil, we just got him just like that. So Steph welcome to kind of the squad yeah i feel like he definitely should be a galaxy opal just because me personally now i just like seeing the galaxy opal glow and i like using galaxy opals the good part about it 
is him being a pink diamond will bring down his price quite a bit more but i don't know it's just a personal preference and it's kind of weird the fact that i don't know i might actually want carmelo anthony more than i want galaxy opal hakeem right now so anyway I'm speaking this into existence, hopefully. Hopefully we can get something better than a diamond in this pack opening. That's really all I'm looking for. And Kyrie did also like get the curry slide and stuff like that. So that card also looks crazy. As we finally get Byron Russell, that actually took quite a long time, like 31 packs for us to be able to get him. And we pulled most of the cards now. All we need is the Galaxy Opals and, well, the Galaxy Opal and the Pink Diamonds. That's it. And Glenn Rice, now that I think about it. But, no, okay, well, Byron again? Yup. Wait, what? Is that Byron or Brian? I think it's Brian. I think I read it just then and kind of realized, but there's another shake. Please be something. Okay. Well, you know, that happens, but let me just give this animation for you guys. Locke. Yeah, let me just say something random as well. I just got to say, your guys' support on especially Lamelo's legacy has literally been making me so happy. I don't know. You guys might not be able to, might not know this. But one thing about being a content creator is when you spend a lot of time on a video and also like, getting it out it feels so good to see so much support that's why i ask for support on my videos and seeing how much you guys have been killing it means so much so thank you i guess it's time for another box though because yeah also seeing the support on the videos like that once makes me want to release it a lot sooner like the next episode and that's what i'm doing with the budget squad i feel really good now the fact that we've actually kind of got a schedule of me releasing my series being lamello's legacy and the budget squad and i do have hopefully one more series that's going to come out pretty soon that you guys should love so be on the lookout for that as to be honest this packs definitely haven't been the best but there we go with another shake another diamond all right we need to see glenn rice and then literally we've pulled every single card except the pink diamonds and the galaxy opal western conference that means it's another jeff petrie but i mean it's fine it's another diamond we'll take it we want to see those pink diamonds though six so nothing seven why am i so tired i'm literally sitting here just like why i don't I, anyway we're here doing our video doing our thing and hopefully you guys are enjoying as i'm not really enjoying opening up these packs usually i said i like the flash packs right now not going the greatest but hey i like to record these pack openings to get content out for you guys and also to sustain my pack addiction so hopefully we can get something good so i can get hype but right now on to number 12, we pulled one diamond in this box, and I don't think it's going to be the most expensive one. We've only pulled one Dino, which was kind of weird, especially because it was our first Amethyst we got. Jamal Murray right there, 14. Let's go. Let's... It's okay. Oh, all right. I feel like I have flown through this box because we really haven't seen much at all. 16. Okay. All righty then. Cool. 17. Oh, wow. This box really isn't going well at all. Number 18, and okay number 19 now um ruby all right all right brian russell yeah it is but anyway number 20 which isn't my age now because i turned 21 and there we go maybe because it's not my age anymore they're gonna hit us with the pink diamond and that's exactly what we get right there baby we want to see western conference because i think it's a nuggets mellow and then also Carmelo Anthony. I do want Kyrie, but I don't want him as badly as I want Melo. So let's have a look. Carmelo Anthony. Weston, 96, number 7, number 15. Is that him? That is him. Let's go, baby. Okay, I forgot what number he was on the Nuggets, but that's the player we wanted. Carmelo Anthony, baby. Yes, sir. I love to say, hey, 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 I don't know what I did wrong. I, hey. <laughs> oh, it's a beautiful sight. The final pack of this box hits us with that. That actually woke me up a bit more. How good's that? I feel like I have to do another 20 after how good that one was. So I just bought a bit more VC. Let's get into another one. And also, I do have some exciting news once again. 2K have hooked me up and they have given me the opportunity to be able to give you guys one of these cards from this set in a live stream later on this week so well actually next week because yeah the week's over but yeah that'll be to one of you guys i don't know what card it's gonna be i'm hoping it's either mellow or also a galaxy opal but we'll just have to wait and see but i also do have a locker code as well so that's at least exciting because all of you guys will be able to use that and uh yeah i'll let you know when i get the code as this box again has started very slow but maybe it's going to come clutch like our last one in pack number 20 where we get something fire or we're just going to continue to get rubies and no emeralds and um stuff like that through the whole okay 10 10 10 bang okay i thought that was actually going to be kind of fire if i got something cool there but can this be eastern conference for dino again yes sir okay it's not it's 
It's Jimmy Butler. All right, I didn't expect that, but there you go. Jimmy Butler, thank you. Number 11, though. One of my favorite numbers. And again, we're really not getting much. You know me speaking about the fact that I was turning 21 and um, number 20, like, I can't say that anymore. I used to say 20 is my age, so maybe that's good luck. That's what I used to say. You know, someone in the comments when I said that I was turning 21 was like, I don't want him to turn 21 because I like him saying when he turns over to pack 20 that it's his age. So anyway, that was pretty funny. I don't know. I enjoyed that comment. So there you go. There's proof that I do read your guys' comments. Sure, I don't reply that often, but I do actually read all of them. So I, I, I feel like this whole video has made me just thank you all for the support as we finally get another diamond. Can this one be Glenn Rice? That's the only other card we need for the diamonds. Western Conference, nine. Okay. It is yeah no it is lebron what is happening what is happening with these current day players right now okay very weird but hey we're on 18 right now and this one isn't going to be much we got tight handles costas untent cupo number 19 let's have a look shake right there bang oh, okay watch this be probably like kyrie irving the amethyst easton 91 okay that means i'm pretty sure it's Blake Griffin. Okay, sure. Oh, no. And here we go. This was the pack that came clutch for us last time. This time, it doesn't even give us a shake. We get an emerald to end it off. So we can now do two singles of these flashbacks. And hopefully you guys can see the reason why I'm excited to open these up in Lamella's Legacy. Because I feel like maybe if we're able to get Amethyst as our first single, we do get a shake and we get a ruby. Please don't be Brian. Okay, good. Bang. Oh, okay. Well, it's still just an Amethyst, but maybe Dino once again. Nope, because it's Weston. It's number 77. Have I even pulled this card? Why am I getting so many current day cards? This is so weird, but Luka Doncic, okay. Eyes wide open, drowning, I'm choking, bro. And our final single with VC. You guys know though, I always have to do one with MT. So this pack opening has gone pretty well. The only reason for it though, is because we actually pulled Mellow. If we didn't, then I would say it had gone pretty badly. But one pack with MT, is this going to be the one that makes us clutch? That gives me Hakeem a lot. Okay, well, no shake. An Emerald, sure. Fred Van Fleet. So yeah, if we go over to our collection right now and have a look at Flash Glitched, we did actually get Mellow. And this man looks crazy. I want to see how much he's going for right now. So yeah, not a super amount. But then I want to have a look at how much Hakeem is going for. Is he going for heaps? Yeah, he's actually going for a lot. But I don't know. I feel like this Mellow might be the better card. And this is definitely the card I wanted to do gameplay on. So be on the lookout for that. Because like just looking at this man's stats, I don't understand how it's Carmelo Anthony with um those defensive stats. But anyway, I'm excited to use him. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this pack opening. Sorry if my commentary was a bit weird. Sorry if it was a bit off, but as I said, I'm tired if you didn't know. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I appreciate your support so much. Let's see if we can get those 2000 likes. Also be sure to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And I guess uh, that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.